Hey guys, Trinity Tribe again. This message here is specific for someone. I got Rihanna take a bow. You look so dumb right now. Standing outside my house. Trying to apologize. You're so ugly when you cry. Please, boy, cut it out. And don't tell me you're sorry because you're not. And baby, only know you're only sorry you have come. But you put on quite a show. Barely had me going. But now it's time to go. Curtains finally closing. Now it's time to go. Very entertaining, but it's over now. Go on and take a bow. Okay, guys. So, this is a situation here where you were dealing with an individual. Could have been a king of wands, somebody very passionate, somebody very fiery, somebody that just takes action towards anybody, anything. This person is trying to manifest you back right now. This person is very, ba very, I said balanced, very unbalanced right now and very burdened by you pulling back your energy. This person could have recently came to your house on top of your lawn, in your lawn, something like that, and you told this person to fuck off. Yeah. Talking about girl, the chip will fall. This just looks like a rerun. Eight, eight of cups, like yeah. So my this this situation is ran its course here. Yeah, too many secrets, too many illusions, too much up and down, too much passion in and out, too flighty, too demonic, too much overindulging. Yeah, so somebody here is focusing on their pinnacle with the queen of pentacles and a fool here somebody was overindulging just period here somebody is manifesting different women and men bad bitches and bad men that's only going to be end up in a ten of cups in reverse energy here this is what somebody's manifesting here so somebody doesn't know that they're passionate towards the wrong things here right now somebody here is going to wind up unhappy and all offers taken off the table because this person seems like they're just rooted in passion here. And then they're all over the place. Maybe this person is not getting passion. Could have had up to four different options in the past. We have the Hierophant area. This person was in a commitment offering elsewhere. A very stable commitment that this person was in. And they, separate, they jeopardized it here. So we have the Temperance in reverse uh, clarified by the sun. So somebody here is happy, but somebody here is unbalanced. Yeah. With the moon car here, there's still secrets here uh, that are not illuminated. Yes, yeah, somebody has not taken action towards this. They're holding back. And they're also not taking action towards dropping these burdens. Somebody needs to hold back from somebody here. Yep, we got the four of pentacles again with the eight of cups. Somebody needs to hold back and move forward. Could be from a water sign or Capricorn here. Yeah, because it's only going to end up in Three of Swords. And, you know, we got the King of Pentacles. So the King of Pentacles is uh, heartbroken right now because maybe he's not making money. Maybe he's caught up in a legal system, not able to move forward here. With the Six of Cups, so he's going back to somebody or he's thinking about the past here. Somebody's trying to stay balanced. Somebody's thinking about the past here, trying to stay balanced. Maybe something that they did in the past, secrets weren't illuminated yet. Yeah, somebody, no secrets came out yet. So there hasn't been any judgment call on this, this energy here, this devil energy, this flighty. Somebody doesn't know. Only thing I see now is this queen of swords. Maybe she's cutting off a group setting, quitting a job that was with this queen of, king of pentacles who could be her boss. But somebody here is needing to pull back, hold back their energy here. We have the Nine of Cups, so somebody is explaining to somebody um, or telling the truth about a third party here. Maybe somebody's calling judgment now and saying, why do I give you emotional fulfillment now? 
after all of this devil energy and these third parties, you know, you were fulfilled when you were dealing with this shit, you know, maybe going back and forth with the nine of cups and the six of cups, maybe going back and forth to your past, making babies. You didn't call judgment then. I mean, you, you, you know, you didn't want to bring me justice then. Yeah. You didn't want to bring me shit then. Now when I get in this energy, king of swords, head over heart decisions, intellectually moving forward, strategizing about how I can be better and do better. You want to come towards me with these sad ass stories. But what about the secrets? You still coming to me in the nine of wands energy here. Somebody needs to close the cycle with this person because this person doesn't seem to understand these fucking burdens that they're bringing towards you is causing you instability and they might understand it. Have strength and pull back from this energy here. Because this person here means no good. This person here is devilish. You know, they could have recently got out of a third party or a, a, a setting of work here, but they're still mentally conflicted here. Yeah, with the King of Wands in reverse and the Two of Cups in reverse. So somebody here has, is very freaky, very nasty, but somebody here could have lost passion in a union here because of their trifling ways. Somebody here maybe yeah, because of their trifling ways with the with the devil card. Yeah, because of their trifling ways. This this partnership has fell apart with the Knight of Pentacles in reverse. So somebody here is not offering, somebody here is not giving, but somebody here is blocking out this household union here. This could have been in a household here. Yeah, because somebody's finally using their intuition. Somebody just ran intuition. Somebody has went in soul searching. In the midst of this person going back and forth, rejecting, not offering. Yeah, going back and forth to the past, rejecting, not offering. Somebody here has went on a journey. They're soul searching and self seems to me making this person happy. Yeah, somebody's coming out of this. The nine of swords in reverse. This could have been something. You could have been in a relationship with this person or known this person for four to six years. Yeah, we got the Page of Pentacles in reverse. We have the Two of Swords in reverse. So somebody here does not want to make an offer to anybody anymore. And that's a tower for somebody. Somebody's coming out of confusion and illusions. Some of these secrets have already came out here. Yep, and somebody's heartbroken. Somebody's trying to deal with this, reconstructing. But I see somebody here getting themselves together to receive some blessings here. Don't, don't let this uh, shit weigh you down here. Yeah, we have the two of pentacles. Don't juggle back and forth about this king of cups in reverse because, you know, the nine of cups in reverse, this person is emotionally um, not fulfilled here. Yeah, with the nine of pentacles in reverse, this person really has nothing besides burdens and they're trying to bring them to you. This person may want you uh, around so they can give you some wine or maybe put you in another third party. This could be something that you've healed from, a karmic distorted masculine from a third party situation that they place you in, you were heartbroken about it. Now you're happy and you know, now this person wants to bring you justice. How can they bring you justice? You already found justice. Spirit already gave you justice here. You don't need this person to bring you justice. Find peace within self and move on. Yeah. With the Knight of Wands in reverse and the Fool, don't take action towards this Fool. Yeah, this fool is going to take themselves out by overindulging, smoking, drinking, and fucking. That's going to be this person's demise. Yeah, with the Ace of Pentacles in reverse. This person has and, and a lot of rejection um, coming towards them, okay? Hmm. Bottom of the deck, you deserve love. What do we have here? Codependency. That's where that devil energy comes in. Addictions are affecting your romantic uh, life. Don't let nobody come over to you with this energy here, leeching off of you, you know, especially somebody from the past who you ain't even dealing with right now. So we keep seeing the six of cups that came out twice here. So somebody from the past is, is on its way, on their way to you. Spirit of saying, for some of you individuals, use your, your, your intuition discernment because this is a unrequited love there's not enough chemistry attraction we have reconciliation here and we have you deserve love so somebody here is reconciling with somebody in the past just period romantic feelings has third maybe a situation where you were with this person here you thought you wanted this person maybe you and the person in the past are 
uh, reuniting here. You could have seen something in this, this person here that you're with now and you don't like it. And this person here, your past person could have been a better suit for you here. So that's why the Six of Cups is out here so fondly. And we have make the effort, but that's in reverse here. So whoever you're with right now, Oh, then we have give your relationship a chance. It's 50-50 for you guys, okay? You know how your situation is. Use your intuition. You know, tarot is just, you know, we're here to give some messages and whatnot. But use your intuition. Use your intuition. Only you know your story. What do we have here? Do not retaliate. Let karma unfold. Okay, Gemini? And we have quiet your mind. Find a focus point. Use binaural beats. Okay, some of you guys are needing to listen to those beats to um to help elevate your auras. Some messages here. Oh, you know what? Two minutes. So a couple of messages here. I hate this uh, deck. It's so flimsy here. Stop. STD alert. I'm financially stable now that I left you. So like I said, somebody here is moving towards some sort of abundance here. And this person that you left is probably coming in to take everything that you have. We have, you are the best I ever had. This person knows that about you. Okay. But watch out for this person here with their flighty actions and energy. Okay, this person can have an STD. I know what you did last night. Somebody is... Saying something to you, or you saying this to this person? We have bisexual. Somebody could be a bisexual here. Watch out who you're sharing your sexual energy with. Somebody here could be sleeping around with men and women here. Let's see these, y'all. This could be a soulless individual that you're dealing with. This person doesn't care about anybody. Somebody could have practiced some sort of magic on this union here. My dad does not like you. I'm hiding a drug and sex addiction. All that glitters isn't gold. Can I take you out tonight? I do not like divine masculine or divine feminine. This could be a karmic relationship. You take it how it resonates. You only know your story. Somebody here's uh, fortune is to be a rich bitch here. Through my chastenings, I am changing. So either you or this person could feel this way. Give me another chance to be the man or the woman you need. You could be dealing with a distorted masculine. Somebody here could be pregnant or somebody here could have had a karmic child with this individual. Somebody's third eye is opening. Somebody is recognizing these situations for what they are. You could be dealing with a water sign and we have somebody here needs sexual healing. But guys, before you give that healing out... Make sure that this person is clear from all addictions here. Um, yeah. I'm going to see if you guys were listening to um, any of these songs. If this resonated with you, just let me know. Something that your person might want to say to you. Something that you might want to express to your person here through music. Hey, ooh. Some of you guys messing with a hood, a hood baby. We have pure cocaine, little baby. This person could be a drug dealer. And we have 1942 meat mills flow. So some of you guys are dealing with some drug dealers. Cause um or or somebody who's wrapped up in the judicial system. Cause meat mills 1942 flows. I'm just talking about how you got convicted in the uh, judicial system. Basically, some uh some some harsh time for riding a bike. Your person could ride bikes here. Pure cocaine, little baby sold drugs, so did Meek Mill. So some of you guys, people, um, could sell drugs. We have diced pineapples at the top, rosé. Diced pineapples, my baby girl, she tastes the best. You are the best I ever had, y'all. So uh, I love confirmation. But um, y'all, watch out for these individuals coming your way. I'm going to get one card for empowering question. Something you guys can use to challenge your minds today. Something that you guys can think about. How would I want people to remember me when I'm no longer here? So some of you guys are focusing on legacies. Building legacies and breaking generational curses. Spirit is saying keep on going. You're on the right path. You're on the right path. Okay? 
You are so on the right path, Gemini. Keep on going. Yeah, and on this path, you're going to have envious people, and they are going to be brokenhearted. Bottom of the deck, goddess of the moon. Use your intuition, y'all. That's all I have for y'all. Thank you so much, um, Gemini. I love you guys so much. Um, everybody stay blessed today. Stay cool. Get that water in. Thank you guys so much for taking the time out to listen. If this reading resonated with you just one bit, please like, share, and subscribe. And even if it didn't, still like, share, and subscribe. Everybody stay blessed.